Lithuanian culture, nature, and attractions. Geography and cities of Lithuania. Lithuania, the largest and most populous Baltic state, is situated in Northern Europe, along the shores of the Baltic Sea. It holds the distinction of being the geographical center of Europe. Lithuania shares its borders with four countries and coastline along the Baltic Sea connects it with nine countries. Lithuania has 10 major cities. State symbols. The national flag of the Republic of Lithuania features the colors yellow, green, and red. The coat of arms of Lithuania displays a white knight on a red background. Brief history of Lithuania. Grand Duke Mendogas, the sole king of Lithuania, is credited with unifying and establishing the Lithuanian state. Despite multiple occupations, Lithuania has declared its independence. Period of Russian occupation. Lithuania restored its independence. The country became a member of NATO, an international organization dedicated to safeguarding the freedom and security of its member states through political and military cooperation. Lithuania joined the European Union. Religions in Lithuania. Approximately 79% of Lithuania's population identifies as Catholic. The country doesn't have an official state religion. Due to that other religions, including Lutheranism, Evangelicalism, Orthodoxy, Islam, Judaism, Karaism, and Unitarianism, also have a presence in Lithuania. Key Lithuanian Holidays. New Year. The start of the calendar year. Defenders of Freedom Day. Honors Lithuanian resistance against Russian occupation, with the national flag raised in memory of those who fought and died for Lithuanian freedom. Day of the Restoration of the State of Lithuania. Commemorates Lithuania's statehood, independence, and freedom. Mardi Gras. A winter celebration to bid farewell to winter and welcome spring. The traditional dish of this holiday is pancakes. Festivals and fairs take place in the streets. People dress up as mystical characters and burn mora, which symbolizes the end of the accumulated evil, the spies of winter. International Women's Solidarity Day focuses on women's rights and traditionally involves the giving of flowers to women. Lithuanian Independence Day, a significant historical date, marking the signing of the act that restored Lithuania's independence after a 50-year occupation. Saint Easter, a Christian holiday marked by feasting, egg painting, and the preparation of meat dishes and cakes. Mother's Day, a day to honor and give flowers to mothers. Father's Day, a day to honor fathers. St. John's Eve, a summer solstice celebration featuring bonfires and natural phenomena. The day of the coronation of Lithuanian King Mendogas commemorates the coronation of Lithuania's first and only king. This day is also National Anthem Day. Assumption of Mary, a celebration at the junction of summer and autumn, associated with the completion of fieldwork, harvest, and gratitude for summer's blessings. Day of Science and Knowledge. Marks the start of a new academic year. All Saints Day. A Catholic holiday for remembering and honoring the deceased. All Souls Day. A day to remember and honor the dead by lighting candles at their graves. Saint Christmas Eve. Usually celebrated with family and relatives. Saint Christmas. The celebration of Christ's birth, featuring Christmas trees, gifts, and gatherings with loved ones. Nature and Climate of Lithuania Lithuania experiences four distinct seasons. Spring, summer, autumn, and winter. The country receives rainfall or snowfall on approximately half of the days each year. Summers are the warmest, with an average temperature of 25 degrees Celsius, while winters are the coldest, with an average temperature of minus 10 degrees Celsius. Winter attire is crucial to stay warm during this season. Lithuanian landscapes boast a variety of natural features, including forests, meadows, fields, rivers, and numerous lakes. Approximately one-third of Lithuania is covered by forests, primarily featuring pines, spruces, birches, alders, and oaks. These forests are rich in berries, such as blueberries, strawberries, and cranberries, as well as mushrooms like boletus and porcini. It's important to note that consuming unfamiliar mushrooms, berries, or plants can be life-threatening. 
Lithuania is also home to diverse wildlife, especially birds like woodpeckers, herons, titmice, and cuckoos. The country supports both carnivores, including wolves, lynxes, foxes, and martens, and herbivores like moose, deer, and roe deer. Lithuania's lakes and rivers are inhabited by more than 80 species of fish. Notable attractions. Lithuania boasts a range of visitable attractions, including Trakai Island Castle, a Gothic castle situated on Lake Galves Castle Island. This castle was one of the residences of the rulers of the Grand Duchy of Lithuania. Nowadays it is a popular tourist destination. Gediminas Castle Tower. Located in Vilnius, this castle offers panoramic views of the city and is named after Grand Duke Gediminas. Kana's Castle, a 14th-century castle, the oldest historical structure in Kana's and one of Lithuania's oldest brick castles. The treetop trail in Enikshiai is the first trail in the Baltic states and throughout Eastern Europe where you can walk at the level of the treetops, tops. The path winds along the tops of the trees of the Enikshiai heather, rising up to a height of 21 meters from the ground. The canopy path in the Anikasei Regional Park stretches for 300 meters and ends at the 34 meters high observation tower. The Cathedral Basilica, located in Vilnius, this historic site is the resting place for Lithuania's Grand Dukes. It is important to know that visitors are not allowed during the service. Tours of the cathedral take place only between services. The Hill of Crosses, a unique and holy place in Lithuania featuring thousands of crosses from various regions. It is estimated that there are about 200,000 crosses. The Hill of Three Crosses, a monument dedicated to martyrs in Duke Algird's era. The Palanga Amber Museum, one of the world's largest museums dedicated to amber, housing about 28,000 amber pieces. Klaipeda Maritime Museum, Dolphinarium, the museum started operating in 1971, and since 1994. There is a dolphinarium, the museum is equipped with aquariums, where various sea and river fish and various invertebrates live. Seabirds, and mammals are, housed in the outdoor pools of the fort. The dolphinarium has a hall for 1,000 people, a pool with a capacity of 1800 m cubed for dolphin, and sea lion performances. Since 2003 dolphin therapy sessions are conducted for children with autism, Down syndrome, and cerebral palsy. The Vilnius TV Tower is the tallest building in Lithuania, the eighth among buildings of this purpose in Europe and the 30th in the world. Included in the list of the tallest buildings in the world. At an altitude of 165 meters, there is a cafe, the part of the tower, where the cafe is located, rotates around its axis, which is rotated in approximately 45 minutes. On a clear day, during this time you can see Vilnius while sitting at the table and not moving from your place. Pazaisli's monastery is one of the most impressive masterpieces of Baroque architecture in Europe. It is a state-protected cultural monument and a working monastery. Natural Landmarks Puntuka's Stone Lithuania's second-largest boulder, weighing 265 tons, carved with images of pilots that crossed the Atlantic Ocean in 1933. Parnitas Dune The highest sand dune in northern Europe. Shatriya Mound According to archaeologists, there was a wooden castle at the top of the hill, and people lived on the slope since the second century before Christ. It is believed that one of the most important centers of the old Lithuanian faith was located here. The Stelmuse Oak, one of Europe's oldest oaks, estimated to be about 1500 years old. In all visited natural sites, it's essential to follow visitor rules and requirements. Lithuanian National Cuisine Buona. Skilendis. A smoked meat product made from pork. Cepelinai. Large dumplings made from grated or mashed boiled potatoes filled with meat, cottage cheese, dried mushrooms, or other ingredients, often served with crackers and sour cream. Vedare. Fried pig intestines filled with potato or grit stuffing, available in two varieties, potato and bloody. Shvilpike. Potato dishes, traditionally baked and sautéed with butter, sour cream, 
or served with cottage cheese and cracker sauce. Kugelis. Grated potatoes baked in an oven, often served with crackers. Goldelmate. Dough filled dumplings with various fillings, such as cottage cheese, potatoes, mushrooms, poppy seeds, sauerkraut, and sweet berry fillings. Shaltebarshi. A cold beetroot soup made with boiled or pickled beets, cucumbers, onion leaves, dill, boiled eggs, and kefir. Zhagareli. Traditional Lithuanian pastries made from a hard dough, cut into strips, rolled, fried in hot fat, and dusted with powdered sugar. Gira. A fermented drink made from black bread, fruits, berries, cumin, and other ingredients, often sweetened with sugar. Sola. Juice obtained from birch and maple trees, consumed both fresh and fermented. Sports in Lithuania, notable figures and events. Sports hold a prominent place in Lithuanian culture, with popular activities including basketball, football, ice hockey, rugby, cycling, running, and swimming. Lithuania's national basketball team has claimed three European championships. Renowned basketball players from Lithuania include Arvidas Sabonis, Jonas Valančiūnas, Domantas Sabonis, Jonas Mačiulis, Donatas Motiejūnas, Ruta Meilutite is a celebrated Lithuanian swimmer, known for her multiple world and European breaststroke titles and records. Virgilius Alekna, a Lithuanian discus thrower, is a two-time Olympic champion and record holder, with numerous world and European titles. Zhidrunas Savitskas, known as the world's strongest man of all time, boasts 13 world championships and eight Arnold Strongman Classic wins. Lithuanians are generally reserved but deeply respect their traditions. They often don't initiate greetings with strangers on the street. Public transport users commonly give up seats to the elderly, individuals with disabilities, and pregnant women. When visiting someone, it's customary to bring a small gift like candy or flowers. Lithuanian hosts are known for their generosity towards guests, Greetings typically involve shaking hands, and close relationships may involve hugs. Welcome to Lithuania. The creation of video materials is funded by the Asylum, Migration, and Integration Fund.